stop editing in CapCut. It's not the video editor that will help you grow, improve, or make money. Hey, Arthur here. Welcome to Mobile Vlog. Stick around and you will discover five surprising reasons why it's time to ditch CapCut and which video editor you should switch to instead. Let's start with the positives because yeah, it does have some. First off, CapCut is a solid tool for beginners or anyone who just wants to throw together a quick and simple video. The interface is super beginner friendly. Seriously, even if you've never edited anything before, you will figure it out pretty quickly. It's perfect for basic tasks like cutting, trimming, adding text, or stitching clips together. And let's not forget, it's a social media powerhouse. With built-in templates, music, and filters, you can create a polished video ready to post in minutes. It's like the fast food video editing. Quick, easy, and it gets the job done. That's where the good news stops. For all its strengths, CapCut comes with some serious limitations. It was originally designed for vertical videos, so if you're working on horizontal formats or anything more complex, things start to get clunky fast. The timeline precision, yeah, not great. It's fine for simple edits, but if you are trying to sync up clips or audio perfectly, you're going to be pulling your hair out. And don't even think about advanced features. No proper color grading, no professional audio effects, and forget about multi-track editing. It's a one-track pony, literally. So if you're just making TikToks or Instagram Reels, it's fine. Actually, it's great. But if you're aiming for professional level projects, CapCut is going to feel like editing with training wheels. You will outgrow it faster than you think. Now let's break down each of these points in more detail and really see where CapCut shines and where it totally flops. CapCut seriously lacks advanced features and that's where things start to fall apart. Sure, no one's expecting it to compete with something like Premiere Pro, but even basic tools would go a long way here. Let's talk color grading. And it's pretty much non-existent. You can slap in a filter or tweak brightness, but forget about anything beyond that. Even a beginner editor should have some tools to experiment with color corrections, how you learn the fundamentals. Take Movavi Video Editor, for example. It's beginner friendly, but it still includes essential color grading tools to get you started. CapCut keeps it very basic, like just volume basic. There's no way to fine tune your sound or add real effects, which is a huge mess. Audio is just as important as visuals. So even if you're a total newbie, you should have tools to play around with background music or add sound effects. It's a key part of learning video editing and CapCut doesn't give you the chance to develop those skills. Now the template problem. CapCut is obsessed with templates. Don't get me wrong, templates can be a lifesaver. They are quick, they are easy and perfect for following the latest trends. If you are making TikToks or Instagram reels, templates can help you churn out content fast, but they come with a major downside. If you rely too much on trendy effects and preset transitions, your videos are going to look just like everyone else's. And let's be real, social media is already packed with cookie cutter videos that feel like they're made on an assembly line. CapCut's focus on templates doesn't just encourage this, it makes it hard to break out of it. Now, if you are building a personal brand or trying to create unique standout content, you're going to need more customization options, tools that let you make something truly your own. For instance, Mobavi offers over 6,000 effects from overlays to transitions, along with customizable audio tracks and blending modes. That's how you take your videos from meh, to wow. If you're just starting out with video editing, relying on templates and ready-made solutions, totally fine, no judgment here. Everyone's gonna start somewhere and templates can be a lifesaver when you're trying to figure out the basics. But at the same point, those templates will start to box you in. They will hold back your creativity and limit the growth of your content. Imagine eating the same meal every day. It's fine at first, but eventually, you're going to get bored. Same with editing. If your menu of effects, transitions never changes, your audience will notice and so will you. Let's use an example. Think about the cutout effect. You can create it in just three clicks using CapCut or Movavi Video Editor. In CapCut, you press a button and boom, it's done. In Movavi, you see what's actually happening behind the scenes. You understand the layers, the settings, the tweaks. By learning how things work, instead of just pressing buttons, you're setting 
opening yourself up to be more flexible and creative. You won't just mimic effects, you will start inventing your own. And when you reach that level, that's when things get exciting. Now, here's the part that might sting a little. If you're serious about growing your channel or making money from editing, you need to leave tools like CapCut behind as soon as possible. Why? Because it puts a cap on your earning potential. Here's the reality. Clients see CapCut as a beginner tool. They don't expect or pay top dollar for work done in it. It's like trying to sell a masterpiece painted with crayons. It might be cute, but no one's paying $1,000 for it. Professional clients want editors who use advanced software. They want someone who can create unique, high quality videos that stand out. That's not just a skill, it's an investment in your future. Your unique style equals your value. And this goes beyond client work. Even for personal projects or your vlog, standing out in 2025, means creating videos with a distinct, authentic style. Templates and automation can only take you so far. To truly grow and earn from your content, you need tools that give you creative freedom. So here's my challenge to you. Start stepping out of your comfort zone. Learn the tools that teach you the crap, not just the shortcuts. You will thank yourself when your videos stop blending in and start standing out. All right, let's talk about limitations. You've probably noticed how easy it is to jump into tools like CapCut or Mobile Video Editor. And while simplicity is great, there is a bigger picture we need to discuss. Mastering CapCut means you're really just mastering CapCut. It's built specifically for short form video. TikToks, Reels, Shorts, that's awesome if that's your end game. But these tools are designed with specific features that can actually box you in. Over time, you get used to working with their limits, which can make it harder to adapt when you need to work on other formats or platforms. Think about it. TikToks, Reels, and Shorts didn't even exist few years ago. And who knows what's coming in the next five to 10 years. New social platforms, new formats, maybe even entirely new types of content like VR videos or interactive storytelling. Are you ready to start from scratch every time a trend pops up? I guarantee you every new format will bring a new tool that's just as simple and limited as CapCut. These tools will make things easy, but they will also keep you tied to their automated systems. If you only know how to work with those specific tools, you will find yourself stuck. The creators who really win are the ones who understand the core principles, editing fundamentals, storytelling basics. If you get how editing tools work at their core, you can apply those skills anywhere, no matter what trends or tools pop up, you will stay ahead of the curve. So if you're currently using CapCut, here's my advice. Don't wait too long to level up. Explore other beginner-friendly editors that give you more creative control. Of course, I highly recommend Mobile Video Editor. It's designed to give you the freedom to experiment while learning the ropes of professional editing. And guess what? Right now you can grab Mobile Unlimited with an exclusive 80% discount. Click the link below to grab this deal before it's gone. If you wanna test the waters first, no worries, you can download Mobile Video Editor for free, no time limits, and try it for yourself. And hey, if you're into learning more about editing tips, tricks, and ways to grow your content, hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.